Give us a rundown on your shoe. Thanks. I, um, I've been working on shoes for about uh, 25, 30 years. I am on that uh, design that uh, head gate up there. We did all patent work and stuff on that. And worked working for about five years. We still have customers that have that uh, suit that's 20 years old, that bring them to the shop, have some uh, stuff done on, take it back home, and work with them. Uh, a very, very well built suit. Uh, nothing wrong with it at all. But it's a V bottom suit. And the V bottom suit, what you have is uh, the metal stand at the back of the suit. Uh, see a closer in area for the feet. Uh, the, here, so they're wide open. Uh, they don't have any problems coming into the end of this at all. Everything is parallel side, uh, parallel operation. Uh, Streams together like this. And you notice up here, there's no linkages, no barriers, nothing to go wrong. You have a cylinder, you have a slide that moves back and forth. Very durable design. Uh, very straightforward. And our next tender, uh, the same next tender that was had for 30 yeah, years, sure is at the tweet. And uh, the warm it up, the uh, guys from the cantilevers, uh, stuff like that. Uh, you still have pressure uh, relief on everything, uh, the old form of pressure, uh, the cattle, and uh, the rubber floor. You'll, you'll see a lot of stuff here that uh, is what you're looking for. The guys that uh, know something that's a uh, big deal to do is down here, you see a moving load adjustment, and what happens with a big tail stand in the back of the suit, and less of the gate, with uh, about two inches of travel available there too. And the guys that have this suit now, they'll so sit this side of this suit, they have zero shoulder injuries at all. So they're pretty pumped about that. Thank you, Harvey. We'll have a chance to cover the rest of the ground. We'll also check the people behind the booth back in here. Tom's back there. So uh, check the check the uh, people inside of our, our tent here to look and see what they're doing. All right, we're gonna try to catch the first one. You guys are ready. Everybody's waiting. Uh, it's called electronic stimulation. There we go. All right. I'm going to try to catch this first. All right. Now then, this critter's in this brand new shoe. The neck extender. Uh, notice how you... I imagine that uh, the shape, they don't go individually. They go, they're not individual. They're straight out. Go. Okay, these operate in unison, uh, so uh, notice if you have to give a, an IV injection or a shot, the neck extenders appeared on our cattle shows about, uh, about how long ago, 10 years? Oh, uh, 15. About 15 years ago, these neck extenders showed up, and boy, what a lifesaver they are. Go ahead, go let him out and catch the next one. We got one more. We got, we got front exit. Okay. Peppers, big, big, big. Notice how they enter the kind of, The floor is all rubber mat floor, and there's bars across there to keep them from slipping, but the critters come in so quiet you can't believe it. Uh, if you had to give an ear, ear tag or an injection of any kind, notice how that works. Very, very quiet. Everything's uh, nylon. All right. Got to try one more time. Okay. Okay. He said, I had my head in there once and you tried to catch it. <laughs> now, okay, now will this extend very much? Not a whole lot, but the pressure, you might think, well, that's an awful lot of pressure extending that neck out there. But it's about a breakout about how many pressure? About four or five hundred, something like that? I don't know. Uh, but notice this critter's got a head pulled back in there. And uh, 
Uh, that keeps the, the, there we go. Very good. That's called the, the, the Titan West is called the Easy Care. Easy Care shoot, brand new on the market. Uh, we'll see more of that at Huster Harbor State, probably in Grand Island, Nebraska, in about, uh, about two weeks. All right, our next shoot.